What's going on, YouTube fam? It's your boy Tony Two Times, and we back with another video, man. And I seen some earlier this week. I want to touch on. I seen some pictures trending where Kevin Gates went to visit C Murder in prison, Mac and his homeboy Lee Lucas. Now all these dudes been gone over twenty years. You feel me? C Murder had a situation where he tried to get a appeal where some witnesses came forward about the old case, and they was basically saying it wasn't him. They was basically saying the police coerced them to say it was him, and he really ain't commit the crime. Now, everybody thought C-Murder was coming home after that, but unfortunately, that wasn't the case. It's like they just trying to keep him. His brother, almost a billionaire, you would think that Master P would be able to get him out, but in this situation, it's not about money, you feel me? Everybody say Louisiana super racist, especially when it comes to, you know, black men that got money and power. That's why Boosie left. But I feel like this was real dope with Kevin Gates because I don't see too many celebrities really speaking on C Murder like that, man. You know, and I mean, it's unfortunate his situation, but I just feel like Kevin Gates, a lot of people got their opinions on him, but he do a lot of real things and he say a lot of real things. Even the situation with NBA Youngboy being locked up, everybody thought they was beefing, but he came out with a video basically saying he gonna check on him. He going to write him. He going to ask his mother if he need anything. He going to send him some money. Now, that's real because he pinned that to the side. He pinned all that pride to the side, and he reaching out to these dudes. It's like when you know the feeling and you've been in that situation, you can only imagine. I mean, these dudes got life in prison. You feel me? It's a possibility they never coming home. God forbid that ain't the case. I hope see murder come home. I hope Matt come home, too. I grew up off both of their music. I grew up off No Limit. You feel me? But I just feel like Gates need to get more credit sometimes for the things he do because you got a lot of dudes claiming they real, claiming that they, you know, they understand the struggle, they understand certain situations, but they get that money, they go on, they live their life, and they forget about everybody else that came before them or people that they probably grew up on listening to. And I just feel like, see, murder should have been home if the only witnesses they had back then came forward and basically say he ain't do it. I mean, that's grounds for appeal, and that's grounds to win your appeal, but it ain't go like that. I mean, I don't know, maybe God got different plans for C. Maybe he'll come home, like, in a few years or something. Maybe it's meant for him to help some more people in that. Because Boosie, Boosie basically said when he was locked up with C. Murder, that C. Murder was helping a lot of dudes out. He was helping a lot of dudes with their case. You know, he got, like, a lot more mature to the point he talking to young dudes and stuff like that. And sometimes your journey might be different. You know, it's an unfortunate situation. You feel me? That's like Tookie. Tookie Williams, he was getting his life together. You feel me? Like, they killed him or whatever. You know what I mean? But at the end of the day, he was writing children books. He was trying to give back for the harm he did to the community. So I just felt like this was dope. I just wanted to touch on this story. But, yeah. Gates, man, you know I'm a big fan of the music, you feel me? I've been rocking with Gates for a long time. I rock with C. Murder. I still listen to them, you feel me? I still listen to Old P and stuff like that. But I just feel like this was real. And his homeboy, Lee Lucas, you feel me? He always speak on him in music and stuff like that. I ain't know he was locked up that long either. He basically grew up under him. That's like his OG, his mentor. So it's dope to see them all on the picture together and him be able to go see everybody. A lot of people don't talk about Mac either, you feel me? Mac was with No Limit, you know what I mean? He had a CD called Shell Shock that was like a real hit CD. It was real big in the streets, man. But I commend Gates for this, you feel me? So let me know what y'all think about this situation. Leave your comments below. If you're new to the fan, be sure to subscribe. Hit that notification.